Hi, I'm Steve. I'm an instrument technician here at Fisher. Today's segment is adjusting the zero and the span on the L2E level controller with water in our displacer here, keeping the span on the sight glass. Our zero knob is rotated left or right to move our span up and down the sight glass. Our span knob can be all the way to the left or the right or anywhere in between to widen or decrease our span on the sight glass and therefore on the displacer. Okay, so now we're at minimum span and we want to try to use it. We're going to use our zero knob to adjust our span in the center of our displacer. And if it's a little high, we'll bring it down a little bit, rotating the knob to the left. We're a little low. Bring the knob back over to the right somewhat. Okay, we got about a two inch span at the minimum setting and we're about five and three inches, so that's acceptable. Next, we're going to move the span adjustment knob all the way to the right, which is going to have a major effect on our zero. It's going to be high on the displacer and high in the sight glass. So what I will do is turn the zero knob to the left, about six turns or so to get a little head start on the rise of the level in the sight glass. As you can see, our upper level is around 10 inches now. We're gonna rotate our zero knob to the left. A Couple more turns. whatever it takes to actuate the valve and start the dump process. Got about nine and a half inches of upper level. Five and a half inches of lower level. Rotate your zero knob to the left a couple more turns. Try to get the span in the center of the sight glass and therefore the center of the displacer. Here we have around seven inches upper level to three inches of lower level, and that is acceptable for our setup today. Thank you.